hi guys welcome back to my channel if you're new here thank you so much for stopping by so i'm doing a makeover on my sister she's doing a soft glam today so i'm gonna first take uh, my milo brow pencil in dark brown and i'm just outlining her natural brow then i'm gonna brush her hairs down with the spoolie and outline the top half Now I'm just going to brush our hairs again with the spoolie and I'm going to fill it in. I'm just defining her natural brow. Her brows are plucked, aren't plucked, but she does have a nice shape, so I'm just emphasizing it. Then I'm going to take my LA Girl Pro Concealer in the shade Toffee and I'm going to use a concealer brush to clean up her brows. And this brush is actually from Wet n Wild and was only 99 cent. And it's really good. Like it does a really good job for concealing and cutting crease. And I'm just gonna take my concealer buffer and blend that out, blend it into her skin, and then I'm gonna clean up the top half of her brow. She didn't want any foundation today, but one of these days she's gonna have to let me do foundation on her, but she still looks pretty for her little friend and went to a party today. And these colors look really good on her skin tone too. So I'm just blending in that concealer. And then I'm going to brush her hairs again. And I'm going to take my Maybelline Tattoo Studio Brow Gel in Deep Brown. And I'm just going to set her brows, make sure they stay in place. Next, I'm going to take my Ace of Butte Grandiose Palette. And I'm taking the shade Poppy. And I'm just blending that in her transition area above her crease and blending it up towards the brow bone. I was doing a talk through of the video, but it was too much background noise and my husband walked by and burped hella loud and I was just like, oh no, <laughs> that wasn't going to work. So I had to cut all my background audio out. So now I'm just going to take my LA Girl Concealer White Face and I'm just going to cut her crease. I love her eye shape. She got the eye shape that I wish that I had. And I'm just bringing it down. Then I pat some setting powder on top, some translucent setting powder just to set it. And this is from NYX, I believe. You can use any setting powder that you have at home. Now I'm going to take this shade Jasmine, Prime Rose, I'm sorry, Prime Rose, and I'm going to pack that onto her lid. And I'm going back into that first shade just to blend out the edges, make sure everything is nice and blended. Okay, now for the wing. This is my first time doing a wing liner on anybody. And the first eye I got really good. This one I was kind of struggling with to kind of make it the same. But I'm using my NYX Keep It Matte Liquid Eyeshadow, Liquid Eyeliner in Black. I'm trying to make sure you guys can see me as well and see what I'm doing. fill it in somewhere because one was curved and the other one wasn't so I'm trying to fix it the best I can like I said this is my first time doing a wing on anybody I'm still perfecting it on myself I'm going to take away the tape and then I'm just going to extend it out a little bit I let her do her eyeliner and her waterline because she blinked so much she was making me nervous. I felt like I was going to poke her in the eye. Now I'm taking that same shade, Poppy, and using that to smoke out her lower lash line. 
I also did her mascara off camera. She. Now I'm going to take the shade Jasmine and use that to highlight her brow bone. And I'm also going to use it to highlight the inner part of her eye. Just blending out all those edges. And I use NYX on the rise mascara. Now, this is what I like to do sometimes if I feel like I miss some spaces with my liner, because I'll be trying not to get it on my lashes when I do my lash line. So I'm taking some black eyeshadow and just patting it on the top to kind of darken up the wing a little bit. Get our mascara off camera, so now I'm just taking some gold glitter and outlining her crease. Now I'm just going to take my Cover FX Reflector Deep Palette and do a little highlight here. Then I'm going to use this blush. I'm going to set her face using my Maybelline Lasting Fix Setting Spray and I couldn't find my fan. So now I'm going to take this Huda Beauty Lip Liner and Trophy Wife. Now I'm going to take my Wet n Wild Liquid Cat Suit. I forgot what shade this is, but it's going to be in the description box. If you want to know what shade she's wearing, it's in the description box. But it's definitely a Wet n Wild liquid katsu liquid lipstick. <clears throat> back over with that lip liner all right guys here you have it here's the completed look i really hope you guys enjoyed this video thank you so much for watching me give my sister a makeover i have lots of videos coming soon I have a collab makeup looks for spring some for saint patrick's day it was just fun to do some makeup with my little sis because it's been a while since I did her makeup. Last time I did her makeup was for Halloween, but I think it came out really good. She looks really pretty, not too much. It's subtle and it suits her tones, these colors. But yeah, I post makeup looks daily, try to do two tutorials a week. So I appreciate you guys watching. Thank you guys so much. Don't be a stranger. Don't forget to follow me, subscribe to my youtube and i also have a makeup page i love you guys so much thank you for all the support you guys are the best bye